guys, today we're fitting a LDV T60 Max rear door lock. Um, it's the OCAM rear door lock system. So I'll just show you what's in the kit. You've got the wiring loom, central locking plate with the central locking kit, a bracket, and some bolts. So it's very straightforward, a very fit one, but I'll give you a rundown quickly. So if you come in here, first step would be to take those two bolts out for the handle. That's the handle there, two Allen key bolts. Once you remove those, this plate goes in first on its own. It slides in, making sure this striker sits under the link. And the whole purpose is to lock that handle. As you can see, unlock. So make sure that one there is sitting under the plate and under this link as well, as you can see. So first step is to put that in there, make sure that's sitting correct. Next step is to grab this guy here, goes in under, as you can see. And the point of these are to put your cover back on. So once your cover goes back on, you've got mounting points. Um, you've got two ten, uh, six mil bolts that hold this bracket. You can see these holes. So that slides in, into place, you bolt that in. Make sure these line up so you're not having a hard time putting the cover back on. Um, so in the kit, you've got the bolts there as well. Now you've also got these extras, little spacers, and these bolts. So once, it, once this is all done, you run your wire through, coming out the bottom of the tailgate, and it goes into your central locking. You can pick up the, the wiring to open and close from your rear door, your front door, whatever's easier for you. Um, <laughs> Most of the times I'd go with the front area, but if you can access the rear with no issues, then go with the rear. Um, they're all the same. And that's pretty much it. That's how it works. As you can see, it locks it. Very straightforward. Hope you enjoyed it. Cheers.